looking for the ultimate one route guide to statues of Lilith now that you're farming renown my guide is going to show you the major highlights of these areas as well as some of my recommendations while farming the statues um, that'll hopefully help you along the way uh, we'll begin in the stronghold of Nostrava, a fun event that mimics a lot of what we saw in the beginning of the game with a really fun twist. You'll gather this waypoint as well as getting numbers 2 through 4, which you probably are already familiar with, uh, mainly because these are pretty easy to find just in some trees. Um, and then the number 4, which is going to be just before meeting Lorath. Um, if you didn't pick up any of these, that's totally fine. That's why I went back through these areas and afterwards we'll head west to the Accursed Wastes, coming just to the edge of West Sal Saran Caldera for number five, only to go south for Kata Yasu for number six, where you can find a very challenging stronghold and then a waypoint as well. Next, we're going to head uh, a, a little bit north to uh, grabbing number seven through ten. This is going to be a pretty big trek north and then immediately west across the way uh, and once we reach the edge to number 10 we're going to make a pretty big trek uh, southwest to untamed scarps not scraps uh, where you'll pick up number 11 just before reaching Yorondal and maybe unloading all of that gear that you picked up along the way and then also grabbing number 12 just before um, one of my favorite strongholds that I've done. And we'll find a number 13 at this stronghold as well. Uh, this is going to be Temple of Rot. Uh, it's a really fun stronghold to do. I recommend that you do it instead of just do doing the statue, but you don't have to. Uh, also, we'll pick up number 14 immediately east of that and number 15 northwest of that one um, before grabbing our 16th statue, uh, which is just west of number 10, but the, the loop of this is to do this in one route, so we're kind of looping back around these areas. Next, we'll reach Onyx Watchtower to find a hidden statue and then go outside of the area to grab number 18. Number 19 can be found and number 20 can be found at the border of Kotama Grasslands. These ones aren't too hard to find, but it'll wrap up our guide nicely. In my next part, I'll include statues 20 through 40 starting in Tusma Rift. I want to thank my subscribers for helping me reach 100, and I hope that you found this video helpful. And if you did, consider subscribing to this page as well as my Twitch for more Diablo 4 content. Happy hunting.